the Queen comes to Guildhall for the 40th birthday celebrations of the National Savings Movement. It was in this ancient hall that the movement was launched during World War I. Today, it numbers nearly 10 million members. The Queen tells her audience. My husband and I, our children and my sister, play our part in this. We are all members of the savings group in the royal household. No birthday is complete without a birthday cake. And this one, with its 40 electric candles, weighs 300 weight. It is crowned with an exact replica of the facade of Guildhall, repeated on each of the four sides. Lord Mackintosh of Halifax, the movement's president, escorts the Queen to the cake, and Her Majesty cuts the first slice. A piece of cake will go to each of the 400 voluntary workers who have served the movement since its foundation, and to other leading members. Next, the procession of the 40 candle swords, each borne by a serviceman accompanied by representatives of the regions, the savings banks, and the armed forces. They are placed in holders in front of the Queen. Each has a hilt fashioned like a Roman sword to symbolize the movement's endeavors during two perilous wars, while the candle itself stands for its peaceful day-to-day -day work. The last of the sword candles is set in its place, and the Queen switches them on an effective climax to the 40th birthday celebrations of a great movement.